Hi there, Capricorn, and welcome back to Star Lord is Tarot. This is going to be your tarot forecast for the week of December 17th through to the 23rd. I went ahead and shuffled the cards. Let's see what's going on for the Cappies. First up, we have the Six of Cups in the upright position. And next, we have the Nine of Swords reversed, followed by the Ten of Wands reversed. And then we have the Ten of Pentacles in the upright. And lastly, we have the Four of Cups reversed. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and interpret this reading for you guys. First of all, for your overall energy, you have that of the Six of Cups in the upright position. This is the Blast from the Past card. Um, sometimes can represent reuniting with people from our past. Um, really good energy, and it's understandable. I guess this time of year, as we're closing out yet another year, uh, this can be the card of nostalgia as well. So sometimes it's uh, representing um, just fondly remembering the past in a very uh, good way. Um, it can be, like I said, reuniting with uh, someone specifically from our past, or it could be that you're just... Um, and getting together with uh, people from your past, family members or friends that you haven't seen in a long time and just really enjoying. Could be reminiscing a lot about, um, about days gone by. It's really nice energy when it's in the upright. Now coming into the week of the 17th, you have the energies of the Nine of Swords in the reverse position. This card uh, is good when it's in the reverse position because upright this means we are um, anxious a little bit worrying anxiety that kind of thing and sleepless nights and just stressed out about something but it's in the reverse position indicating that perhaps some of you guys are letting go of some of your anxiety your um, you're not um, having any more sleepless nights maybe you're getting good night's sleep finally and uh, just rest assured you're putting down your worries and your stresses. So that's really good, especially when it's paired with the Ten of Wands in the reverse position. You guys tend to be workaholics. You overwork. And when it's in the upright position, this is you overworking. This is you doing too much, um, carrying too many burdens, too many responsibilities, sometimes too many worries. When it's in the reverse position, however, we're letting go of these worries and we're letting go of some of the duties and responsibilities. Maybe some of you are finally delegating um, some duties to others and not taking on so many burdens for others of you it could just be letting go of worries because it with it being paired with the nine of swords reversed this uh definitely indicates just releasing those worries maybe you guys are gonna have a good start to the week which is really really good by lessening your burdens especially with the holidays coming up for those of you that do celebrate it it's good to see you guys um uh, attempting at least to relax a little bit now moving towards the weekend of the 22nd 23rd you have the energies of the ten of Pentacles in the upright position this is really good uh, energy going towards the weekend the ten of Pentacles represents feeling really um, abundant on the financial level yes definitely it could be feel you could be feeling really um financially uh secure and stable within the home and the family situation because this is also a card representing family and again the time of year it um, definitely makes sense a lot of you could be celebrating with family and could be feeling very abundant and very secure because pentacles also represent our security as well and this is uh, feeling extremely uh, fortunate and abundant on the uh, security level and on the financial level so maybe that's what it is you guys are not worrying about your finances and you're not worrying and you're dropping some of the load in terms of delegating some work perhaps and uh you're just not worrying so much about things really good to see for you guys and the last card you have that ends up out the week which is the weekend of the 22nd 23rd is the four of cups in the reverse position 
I like this energy reversed as opposed to upright because the upright can represent emotional uh, boredom, uh, ho-hum, uh, apathy, sort of uh, closing off of the emotions. When it's in the reverse position, however, it kind of points back to the Three of Cups, which is a card of uh, celebrations and having uh, good times with uh, family, friends, and people that really bring emotional abundance to us so um you're coming out of emotional apathy into feeling really good on the emotional level and it looks like security level you're good and solid there it's a good family card um looks like it could be a very good week for you guys L you're le lessening a lot of your worries and your burdens which is a big part of uh of the the good energy that you have going on here capricorn so I hope this reading helped you. If it did, please feel free to like, share, and subscribe. And for any of you having birthdays this week, happy birthday to you guys. And I will see you next week, okay? Take care. Bye for now.